Hi guys, it's Riley from Rocket Zero, and welcome to another vehicle tutorial. In this vehicle tutorial, we're going to be going over how to build a garbage truck. Now, this took me like about an hour and a half to build because I just couldn't decide what looked good and what didn't. So I ended up with this. I think it looks all right. So let's build it. What do we need? We just need some black wool, a button, stone slab, green wool, block of quartz, uh, quartz slab, quartz stairs, glass, and glass pane. So let's go, I guess, build it here. We're going to start with our black wool, and then we're going to skip a space, place one. Oh, God, went too far. Okay. And in between, we're going to put a stone slab, three in front, and then an additional two in the middle. Now we're going to grab our green wool, and we're going to place four blocks. So three going this way, one on top, three going this way, one on top. And now on the bottom, we're going to grab our stone slab, and we're going to do the floor. So bringing it back. Now here, we can start with the glass. So we're going to place three glass blocks, and then glass pane on the left, and on the right, so he can see what's behind him. Now we need to figure out where Steve's going to sit. So we need to go grab a steering wheel. That's going to be your brewing stand. So let's grab that. Let's just replace, I guess, this block. Now let's grab Steve's head. We're just going to replace this other block. And now brewing stand goes here. But we need somewhere for Steve to sit. So let's go grab our stone brick stairs. There we go. No, I didn't pick him up. Got to grab him again. And replace the brewing stand. Now we're going to place those down. And on top, we're going to put Steve. Oh, God, he's facing the wrong way. Okay, now he's facing the right way. Now, after that, we can start with the back of the truck. So we're going to grab our stone slabs, and we're going to place three more. So one, two, and three. Now, two black wools. We're going to fill in this gap here. Three more. One, two, and three. Two black wools. One and two. And now, stone slabs in the middle. Now, let's put our buttons to finish that look of the wheels. Now, three more buttons on this side. One, two, and three. And there we go. Now we can start with the actual like garbage, where the garbage goes in. So we're going to grab our quartz block and we're going to put five and then down and to the left. So maybe I went too quick here. So just do the same on this side. We're going to put a block here so we can extend it. And now one, two, three, four, five, right below it and to the right. Now we're going to grab our quartz stairs and we're going to put them upside down so that they end up looking like that. Same thing on this side. We're going to put them upside down. And then on the top, we're just going to put them normally. Same thing on this side as well. Now, after that, we are going to grab our stone slab. So let's finish the cap. Then another row right here. And there you go. That's the front of it. Now let's finish the back. For the back, we're going to put our quartz stairs like so. And here and here. And after that, let's just put some quartz slabs here. Nope, that's not right. I think I used stone. Stone slab. Actually, no. I used stone bricks, but we'll fix that later. <laughs> now that we did that, let's go take a look at this guy. Yeah, it looks right. Okay. Just making sure I'm got him even for you. Now, for the top, what we need to do, we need to go grab our stone brick slabs. We're going to replace this block. Which one? That one. And then we're just going to line the top. But before we do that, we still got to figure a way how to get inside. So let's do the stone brick stairs back here. Match them up so they're even with the quartz one. With the quartz block ones. There you go. That was difficult to say. And now right here, we need to leave a gap so we can get inside. Actually, let's just break it and let's start then. So we need to grab stuff that look like garbage. So just go to your same place and let's see what we can find. I guess this color, this one, and which another one? Maybe like a lighter one. There we go. Now, let's just start placing them in random spots. You know what color I should have grabbed? I should have grabbed black, because that's what most garbage bags are actually, like, colored. So, but that's too late, so let's just figure this out, but make sure not to trap. Oop, I missed a spot here, but make sure not to trap yourself here, because we don't want to break anything that we don't have to. Only a couple more. Gonna have to take that block out. I need to get out now, so. A couple more. Just make sure the ones out here are three different colors, so it looks cool in the outside. All these ones in the middle doesn't really matter, but... You know, why, why not spend some time to do it right? So, one more block. Actually, no, a couple more blocks. Two more. One and two. And there we go. Now, our stone brick slabs on the top. Fill in that gap. And now we need to add some detail. So, let's go flush out our inventory. But first, let's replace that with stone brick stairs. So it's actually right. Now we can flush out our inventory. Let's go grab some glowstone. An item frame. Some red wool. And what else? Also some green carpet and a ladder and that's all for now. So we're going to grab our item frames, put them in the back, put red wool inside. That's going to be our brake lights and then our ladder. So the garbage truck 
guys can get inside and just do their stuff and they can hold on to the back while the truck is moving and in the front we need two item frames for our glowstone to go inside that's going to be our headlights now let's grab our green carpet so at the front of the truck it's all one color now in the back you know what we need we need a lever so let's go grab that lever that way they can flip it and the garbage can be crushed and all that other good stuff maybe next video we'll make it our red zone so it actually works so let us know what you want us to build down below in the comments. Subscribe if you haven't so you can stay up to date with our newest videos. Make sure to hit that like button if you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.